tutorial number 21 and I'm calling it Danger Danger. Why? Because I got an email from uh, one of my former students and she asked this question. Can you have two answers to a puzzle? And my answer is simply this. No. A purist will say there's only one answer. So what do we do about it? Well, first of all, let me show you danger, danger on the board here. You may be doing a puzzle where you have, in the case of here, found two matching pairs, a 5-7 and a 5-7, but they make up a rectangle. And you may say, well, if this was a 5, that would be a 5, and that would be a 7, and that would be a 7, but you could also have if this was a 7, and that would be a 7, and that would be a 5, and that would be a 5. In other words, you get two answers. If you come across a situation in a puzzle where you've got a rectangle of matching pairs, you've either, one, made a mistake, or two, you've got a puzzle that's been poorly planned. Now, let's look at the 2-4 situation here. I had a student once who said to me, Oh! I just simply saw here we had a chance to get matching pair and another chance to have a matching pair here, so I just eliminated the eight. Well, first of all, you never do that because you don't know whether it's a two, four or eight there. Uh, and we know one of the basic rules of Sudoku is not to guess. But that's what the student did. They er erased or got rid of the eight so that they can now say, oh, I can get a two, two, a four and a four, and I've solved all that. Or I could have a four, four, and a two, and a two. Uh, 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 danger, danger. Here we are. I think I'm going to add a little bit more to this tutorial because I did the tutorial months ago and I discovered there is more to share with you. If you may remember that a danger, danger situation is when you've got two matching pairs in a rectangle, and like we have here, two, four, two, four, two, four, two, four, but there's an extra number here, an eight, and the temptation is to get rid of the eight and then you can solve these other numbers very easily, but it's still guessing, and it may not necessarily work, that's for sure. But here's my suggestion. If you come across a situation like this, go ahead, solve as much of the, the puzzle as you possibly can, but you'll be amazed that you'll discover that usually that extra number is in fact the real number that goes there by solving it properly through using logic. So, have fun. Watch out for Danger Danger.